Hello fellow riders and welcome back to another episode of Product of the Week. I'm Trace with Mountain Bike Action and today we've got five brands that we're going to cover. We've got some trusty products from Dynaplug, a helmet from Smith, Trucker Co. Sealant, Zelio Sun Care, and a cooler from Ice Mule. First up, we have a product that has literally changed our riding experience and has helped us get home multiple times. We have here the little racers and the carbon racers from Dynaplug. Dynaplug offers an entire range of different sizes and different ways to store the Dynaplugs, but they each have the same function. The one that you see here is the carbon racer priced at $47.99 and comes in a few multiple options. The reason why we like this one is it's lightweight and can be placed right on your wattle bottle cage with the included holder. The refills for each Dynaplug is $11.99 and you get a pack of five. This side has two different sizes, kind of the spearheaded side and one of their soft tips and more of a bullet rounded end. The repair plugs are constructed from a viscoelastic rubber impregnated cord and non-abrasive brass tip. To use the Dyna plug, you simply align it, push in and pull out. Pretty simple and straightforward, great application in order to get yourself back on the trail. And repair can last the life of your tire if installed correctly. Up next, we have this great helmet from Smith that's designed to be a lightweight full face intended for enduro riding. Kind of a mix of downhill, BMX, a little bit of that. Let's go ahead and dive into some of the tech that's involved in this guy here. Out of the box, we noticed that the Smith mainline had some great styling for a helmet. It's a sort of moto touch with the enclosure straps and the plush padding. After installing the correct size pads to dial in the fit, we hit the trails. Although heavier than some of the other options in this category that we've tested, we found it very well balanced front to back. It breathed well, but considering the hot summer heat wave in SoCal, we did want a bit more airflow. Overall, the mainline has been providing some great comfort during our test runs. Packed into this helmet is a lightweight in-mold construction featuring complete corduroy coverage to provide integrated skeletal structure and complete ventilated protection. With that addition, there is also MIPS lining to reduce rotational forces that the brain is exposed to during an obligated impact to the head. Smith helmets are created to be efficient, absorb direct impacts, and when combined with MIPS, the helmet's inner liner is separated from the head by low friction slip plane that allows the head to slide during impact and may reduce instances of traumatic brain injury. The main line features 21 optimized vents and utilizes air channels that combine with an open intake to exhaust ports that maximize ventilation and breathability. We use the medium pads, but the helmet comes with three sets of uniquely sized cheek pads and two sets of uniquely sized crown liners. These performance pads are all comprised of HyperX static and X2 antibacterial material. All components can be easily removed for cleaning with additional features including an adjustable visor and D-ring chin fastener. The mainline retails for $300 and will be available exclusively at select bicycle retailers. We go through a lot of tubeless tires during testing, but we always seem to go back to this trusty sealant here from Trucker Co. The Cream 2 from Trucker Co. is a high performance tire sealant. It uses a natural latex based and it can be used with tubes, tubeless, or a tubular system. It's non-toxic and eco-friendly. Not only that, it is also corrosion inhibitors to protect your alloy nipples and rims. This formula is competition tested and has been race proven. And we will attest, we've used it in many, many tires and it's been great. We will say it doesn't have quite the longevity that Orange Seal does, but with that being said, coming in at 20 bucks, it's also a lot cheaper for a large bottle. Next up on our list is some skincare from our friends over at Zelios. Zelios' sunscreen is an SPF 45. It's 8% micro zinc to zinc oxide with other active ingredients, filters 98% of harmful UVA and UVB rays that can cause skin damage. This is the FDA's highest water resistant rating with 80 minutes. It dries completely clear with no chalky or greasy residue, is unscented and oil free. It's easy on sensitive skin, won't clog pores and feels light as lotion. The biggest thing and the most noteworthy for us is that it does not sting our eyes and can be worn above the eye line. This is a three ounce tube that costs $14.95, but they also offer a 32 ounce bottle that can be refilled for $120. Overall, the little three ounce tube is perfect. It's something we can keep in our pack. 
We keep one in our car as well in case we forget to apply sunscreen before going out for a ride. Last on our list for this week's episode, we've been keeping it cool with one of Ice Mule's coolers. We have here the entry level Ice Mule Pro Backpack Cooler. This particular model clocks in with 23 liters of beverage hauling capability. The large Pro can easily load up to 18 cans plus ice, making it ideal for a day adventure. In our testing, we found no other soft cooler out there that is easy to carry and is easy to load up and even easier to unload than the Ice Mule Pro. The cooler can retain an ice for over 24 hours and as a bonus, it even floats. While this might be a very large pack if you're out deep in the woods, this pack is great for a quick adventure out in order to get some snacks, bring a picnic, bring a whole lunch with you, and keep everybody fed. We'd like to thank you all for joining it in on this episode. We're gonna have more of these coming up, so make sure to follow us along for more, and also click back and check out some of the other episodes that you might have missed. Until next time, we'll see you out on the trails and ride safe.